All right, my dear friends, moving on to the next bag. I just pulled it out of my stash. Let's see what we have here. This one's not big, but yeah, let's see how it goes. All right, so welcome back to your Vintage Beauties. My name is Yana. All the items here that you see are for sale until I, um, or unless I say otherwise, okay? Sometimes I just call them out during the video if I want them real badly. But in general, everything is for sale. If you like, if you guys want to know how much it is and um, just start a conversation with me, please email me at yourvintagebeauties at gmail.com. Please include timestamp of the item and a brief description of it. And if it's from a previous video, also include the name of the video. But usually three days after the video, the previous items uh, are gone. So... All right, all right, let's, let's get going. Let's just pull some out of this bag and, and see what we get here. First of all, this very beautiful wrap bracelet. I like these. These are like glass beads right here, multiple um, different colors. Very pretty, very pretty and uh, multiple um, kind of um, button closures and you can just adjust them so it goes like this and then you close it very pretty earthy kind of greenish colors greenish and blue colors i don't see any name on this button yeah i don't see any names but yeah pretty bracelet silver tone necklace uh, let's double check rhinestones looks like all the rhinestones are here these are glass kind of blue cat's eye silver tone remind me a little bit of listener um, let's see who this is this is Judy Lee let me let me a close a little bit closer Judy Lee right here silver tone I need to clean it a little bit but looks like it's yeah looks like it's an uh, vintage item we have we have a hook closure this one shepherd's hook closure yeah very pretty very pretty let's see okay this goes straight to um, craft this thing I have a couple of bracelets like this oh this one this one has a tag what is it like HB or BB BB I think I'm not quite sure these are definitely natural items my presidium is not on Let's see, these are definitely natural stones. And this one's, I doubt, this one looks like um, acrylic to me. Yeah, this, let's see, this one's pretty heavy stones. Some type of jade, Jedi or quartz. Yeah, and this one's are, yeah, basically. Let's wait, let's wait. All right, stretchy bracelet, um, painted white shells. Let me straighten you guys out a little bit. And acrylic beads, not lucite. They don't give up any color. Let's, let's take a look. Um, this one goes kind of in the middle of, I would say this one, some type of quartz. It goes in the middle of tanzanite and aqua, but I don't know, honestly, I'm not really versatile. And this one's definitely probably, yeah, this one's uh, plastic. All right, bangle bracelets, stretchy bracelets like I've already seen. Let's see, let's take this one out. 
um, kind of um, bolo reminds me of bolo tie necklace we have this thread black thread and the button uh, or kind of a bead to make it shorter and right here we have um, hearts pendants on the back of them it says em i think on each and one of them it says em or e h no em yeah i think em let's take a look I'm not sure if they're, I think they're slightly magnetic. I want to take, I want to know what EM is. And that's it. That's all we have here. Yeah, that's all we have. Okay, let, let's grab this multi-stranded thingy necklace, because otherwise it's going to, on everything let's see if it's only one here yeah okay oh, there it is all right so here is necklace so what do we have here is um, suede cords they're gray in color we have toggle button closure and then it comes down to multi stranded and a layered necklace there are seed beads there are small glass beads very pretty bluish grayish color they tad bit layered there are no adjustments or anything it's just as is um hair clip gold tone with four pearls kind of a circle very pretty very clean yeah, very clean hair decoration i'm not quite sure what this is some type of religious relic yeah so pray for us different saints i think okay my magnet um, stretchy bracelet I don't like the stretch yeah the stretch is kind of um, beads are glass yeah all beads are glass this is uh, I mean you can take it just for the like uh, from the craft for the um, glass beads and restring it that's yeah very nice blue color another necklace yeah another necklace kind of like a um, curtain looking necklace silver tone lobster claw no name and we have different rhinestones um, they I doubt their glass I doubt they're glass. This gray ones, yes, definitely not. But we also have faceted ones right here. And they are glass. So, uh, let's take a look at this. Rhinestones. Also glass. So, the gray one that are kind of positioned like uh, curtains, they are not glass. But this one, faceted ones, they are. And we also have rhinestones right here they're also glass it's, it's pretty it's very pretty cute I'm not quite sure if let me see oh, like this probably would be better okay all right separate oh my mine knotted really tight over here where is my pointy thing there we go
very easy to untangle with this. Okay. This is very peculiar thing. Silver tone necklace, no name, and we have lungs. <laughs> and there is something inside. I'm not quite sure if it's... Oh, it's just painted. Yeah, it's just painted black, maybe like enameled. But these are pendant and these are lungs. Okay. Uh, gold tone bracelet, uh, fold over clasp. Very simple. I don't see any names or anything. Yeah, no names. And in a pretty good condition, two strands. Yeah, bracelet, gold tone. Another bracelet, silver tone with butterflies and maybe um, um, abalone shells that were protected by resin on top. Very clean. Very good condition. No name. Okay. Another necklace. Silver tone. Let's see. It's probably more than one strand. Yeah. Looks like two stranded with those kind of stationary hammered discs. Let me see. It's because it's two strands, they kind of, yeah, got all ting tingled. This uh, stations are pretty nice in a uh, way. They're solid. They are solid. How close we are to untangle you. Okay, pretty good. So, um, two strands, right? Yes. We have a silver tone necklace, we have lobster claw, two strand, and we have this, uh, two strands are layered. Uh, one is shorter than the other. We have this solid stationary kind of uh, hammer discs. Pretty. Um, couple bracelets. So this one is just a silver tone with kind of knots right here bangle bracelet we have copper and brass twisted flat uh, cuff bracelet i kind of like this one it's pretty and another silver tone cuff um bracelet bangle bracelet just keep swimming it says on it just keep swimming also no name silver tone uh, right here we have a stretchy bracelet. Stretch pretty good. We have hematite and we have this pink, um, yeah, maybe those shreds. There we go. Um, we have hematite beads and pink beads, kind of like eye looking <laughs> pink glass beads. Stretch is good. Another hematite stretchy bracelet. There we go. Stretch is okay. Yeah, pretty good stretch. Hematite. We have another hematite necklace right here with um, sunstone. You know sunstone is a man-made kind of a glass stone, right? Yep, registers as glass. So we have a pretty long hematite necklace, lobster claw closure, and we have hematite beads and sunstone chunks, chips. Um, right here we have another, okay, another bracelet, another Larry Moore necklace, this one on the, oh my goodness, isn't it Gucci? Isn't this Gucci sign? 
Peruzzi Florence. So we have a bracelet. It opens like this. Cow bracelet. This is leather, black leather. And I think this is a Gucci sign. I hope it's real. It's gold tone. The gold tone kind of wears off inside. But right here is... Right here is... Good. Good condition. And it says... Peruzzi Florence. Is this real? That's pretty cool. If it's real Gucci. I think it is. Let me know, guys, if I'm mistaken. Um, let me take this one. So we have a thread and we have a Larimar um, stone here. Very pretty Larimar stone. The, the last time I found earrings that I kept, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this one, but I really love the stone. The stone reminds me of clouds or the ocean. It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful stone. Okay, let's take this one out. So we have a twisted gold tone breakout bracelet. Um magnetic yeah, it's just twisted then we have a oh I thought it was stretchy it's not stretchy it's um, silver tone bracelet not stretch it's a chain and we have this uh, chips of um, shells on it cuteness all right I'm trying to untangle this while I'm showing you something Let's see. This one right here is a glass necklace. This one. I can feel the heaviness of glass beads. They're very nice to touch. Okay, let's see. I think. There we go. There we go. All right, so right here we have a kind of a choker necklace, uh, black thread, you can make it shorter or longer, and we have a Larimar chunk, Larimar stone as a pendant right here, absolutely gorgeous. Next, this is just the chain. Let's see if we lost any pendants, any loose pendants in here. Oh, uh, this one, oh, this might be silver right here, this one, so let's... Uh, Oh, maybe not. Let's be nice and untangle it nicely. Okay, let's see. This one doesn't seem to be magnetic, but the chain is. So we have a silver tone chain with lobster claw. I need to I need to tie those knots and we have this very pretty pendant with the flower i totally forgot the name of this one but it's one of the kind of like healthy flowers very health beneficial um i don't see any stamps on it i don't think so um i can test it for silver if you guys want me to but the chain is not silver let me grab this one So two stranded necklace, silver tone, silver tone uh, chains with glass beads. Absolutely beautiful art glass, dichroic glass. Um, the layered, gorgeous necklace. I don't see any names, but I like this glass beads. Very pretty. Now let's take a look at what we have here. Some kind of a strand with beads. These are though pretty beads. They're kind of ceramic beads. Yeah, I'm going to put this one to craft. Let me know if you want to have these beads. Here is another 
um, necklace like this. I'm not a fan of these strands, but I like glass beads. Very pretty, very pretty art glass. And these dangly ones are glass also. So this one is just worth taking for the beads. Straight. Okay, it's broken, guys. I'm just putting this on to craft. It all falls apart. I don't even know what's going on here. Okay. Craft. Um, silver tone necklace. No name. A little letter J. Big letter J with rhinestones. Bedazzled J. Pretty big. Very clean condition. This one probably the... Is it... Um, Um, I thought this one was um, the oh yeah it is it is origami owl I always look at, um, around so we have origami origami owl uh, necklace with shadow box and it's all about soccer I think um, well not really it does have soccer it has Eiffel Tower swimming all about sports yeah there is a lot of oh in art I think yeah in art all oh, very interesting and books very interesting collection of things and here is origami owl stamp okay nice 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 oh this is interesting so we have a very interesting necklace there are no closures so we have this necklace black plastic beads this kind of two stations and then we come down to this pendant yeah i have no idea what to make of it i'm gonna put this on to craft so let me know this seems to be glass oh yeah this is definitely glass right here yeah all right next Stretchy bracelet, purple color, stretch scoot, four strands. What do we have here? We have, I think all these are plastic beads. Yeah, there is a little bit of movement on some. They might be, uh, yeah, but I would call them plastic beads, four strands. Yeah. Bracelet jasper bracelet magnetic closure and jasper b um chunks kind of chips jasper in maybe yeah i think they're all jasper just different types of jasper bracelet um jasper uh, chunks very interesting necklace so we have a brown leather it's kind of yucky and we have this brushed gold toned beads they're pretty heavy they're solid yeah i now i'm thinking putting this one to craft a very interesting necklace love unique stuff like that i don't see any names but still this is very unique very unique i will need to research who made this so we have a silver tone um chain no name lobster claw and then we have this uh, bib style necklace floral very pretty it's kind of a column um flowers and um butterflies and rhinestones absolutely this one is actually a statement very nice statement necklace i wish it had name I am surprised there is no name on this one. This one is definitely a conversation starter. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. You know what? I think there is a name right here. I just don't think I'll be able to read it. See right here on the bottom? Yeah, like right here. I will try to research and see who made it. But I don't see anything else, and I, I doubt I'll be able to. It's very unre unreadable. Yeah, I'm going to research this one. 
this one very unique and gorgeous look at this okay moving along stretch your bracelet with polymer clay beads um oh pretty bracelet three strands i think right yeah glass beads ab coated three strands and we have very pretty closure i just need to put one rhinestone right here other rhinestones are in place i don't see any names at all for some reason we don't know who made this one but it's pretty we go straighten it up, straighten it up a little bit it's a little stiff guys to be honest the beads were kind of put tight it's a really stiff but yeah glass it's cute and i will definitely be fixing that rhinestone okay stretchy bracelet plastic beads and anchor and uh, this thingy yeah glass necklace okay let's see who made you silver tone lobster claw we have a tag here it says worthington okay worthington glass necklace so we have green and blue glass beads and right here we have a very um kind of substantial glass blue glass pendant pretty pretty blue necklace one more bracelet pull bracelet uh, we have natural stones right here and multi-stranded um, kind of a suede and leather and different decorations and this one i think this one's a how light it just colored yellow a uh, yellow yellow colored yellow and it pulls really nice holds really nice okay so next one is we have um, looks like it, this one is vintage the beads are heavy they i think they're glass yeah they're glass beads they're some the kind of substantial glass beads black uh, we have gold tone closure and we have this stamp right here not quite sure who this is it is a flower if i'll find anything i'll put it here but if not um and you guys know who this is let me know yeah i think this is all we have all right and these beads are have some weight and they're pretty hefty okay moving let's take everything out next we have this gold tone bracelet um there is a oh this one is avon gold tone and we have a letter p with rhinestones right here very good condition my son's name philip <laughs> okay really good condition avon Right here we have um, a baggie. Let's see. Oh, it's multi-stranded collared shell necklace. Okay. The shells are pretty substantial and have some weight, and they're colored in very pretty bright colors: green, blue, and purple. And there are three strands, and they're slightly, uh, slightly, slightly layered. I don't. Yeah, I don't see any names or anything. stretchy bracelet yeah stretch is good but i don't like this you know it needs to be tightened up a little uh silver color rhinestones um beads their glass another stretchy bracelet this stretch is not good it's pretty stiff but i like the beads i like this glass blue beads they kind of crackled inside 
see see the crackle very pretty it needs to be really strong gold tone bracelet let's see what it says on this medallion rotary international okay what's here oh i don't know some kind of stamp not sure what it means it's not not magnetic it's not magnetic are there any stamps no well i'll test it for i can't figure out what does it say here some kind of logo i think right because i don't see any yeah it's not magnetic but i doubt I doubt it's gold or anything, but I can test it. All right, what else we have here? Oh my goodness, look at this stretchy bracelet. Stretch is okay, but it starts splitting into multiple. Yeah, it starts shredding. And this one are acrylic. Yeah, acrylic beads, clear beads. Very interesting. <laughs> Oh, another one of these bracelets from a BB, I think, right here. I I keep seeing this, and I think once in a while I I figure out what it is, and then I keep forgetting. Um, kind of a rose goldish wire and faux pearls. Stretchy bracelet, uh, black glass, small beads, yep, glass this one's interesting a gold tone necklace with um, this cross reminds me a little bit of um, forgetting this cross name Maltese kind of a cross right let's take a look CZ's this ones are CZ's all right let's see Let's see if we see any names. I don't see any names on the cross itself. It's magnetic. Chain is magnetic. All right, so just gold tone. I wonder who makes it. No name. But it's really, really pretty, this cross is with uh, cubic zirconia rhinestones. A real bit that reminds me of, like I said, Maltese. What do we have here? We have a chain, gold tone chain with a very, very pretty snowflake. Um, I think word for it, uh, what for, uh, Waterford, Waterford, yeah, um, did make um, jewelry with their um, glass crystals. Yeah. Um, usually they sign it. This one is not signed, but it's a very, very gorgeous snowflake. And this pendant is on the gold tone chain. Yeah, magnetic gold tone chain. Very muted gold tone chain. I wouldn't be surprised if this one is Waterford. Yeah, pretty necklace. This one is interesting um you know i'm gonna put this one to craft the wire is very stiff and this one is metallic pendant this one will be in craft let's see this brace uh, bracelet cuff bracelet clamper huh, very pretty bronzy color with this owl <laughs> um, plastic eyes cute Pretty big though. All right, another necklace. We have um, glass and wooden beads, and we have uh, natural stone right here. Um, I do think this necklace needs to be redone because look how much stretch is right here. It was stretched out. This, um, like a fishing wire, was stretched out. So I'm going to put this one to craft. 
Uh, this one just fell off of this. It says Earth Nuggets Stretch Bracelet. It was on this one. So right here we have a very, um, very nice stretch bracelet. Um, probably Onyx. Yeah, probably Onyx right here. Black uh, chips. I'll keep this one together with this. And three more necklaces. I oh, know, a couple more necklaces and bracelet. This one is glass necklace. This uh, text says New York. Silver tone, lobster claw, and very pretty blue color dichroic glass and kind of a faux pearl flat uh, beads. Very pretty. Very pretty. Uh, right here we have um, silver tone barrel clasp closure and then we have hematite beads and rice pearls cuteness and pair of bracelets this one is stretch stretch is good we have kind of like silver tone jump rings and we have i think glass let's see yeah some glass some yeah, the glass beads right here, kind of. Yeah, n n not amethyst, they're glass. Some glass, some are not glass. Like this one's not. This one is. Yeah. Interesting stretchy bracelet. And here's another stretch bracelet. Seems to be okay. Stretch. The beads are glass, the big ones. Yeah, kind of dark brown color. Okay, all right, guys. Um, maybe a little shorter today, but we finished with this bag now. What I want to know is actually, I want to research this necklace. This one is very captivating, beautiful necklace. I love unique stuff like that, and I also want to research this. I wonder if it's a real one. I think it's Gucci, right? Like GG. Uh, upside down. I want to research this one. Looks like it's pretty old, but still. Yeah, let me know. I always look forward to your guys' thoughts and uh, ideas. Um, but thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to subscribe if you like content like this and become a, a member of our family, uh, your Vintage Beauties family. I'll leave your comment, leave a th uh, thumbs up, and I'll see you guys next time. All right? Bye-bye.